In the previous video, we looked at how to create an EndNote library and how to insert a citation and then the reference at the end of our document in the references section. So EndNote has generated these in piece of information for us. But we might find that some of the output isn't quite right or we need to make a change, usually a minor change, where things may need to be underlined or a comment may need to be inserted. For example, in my citation, I may want to have a comma appear after the author's name. If we want to do that or make any changes to the appearance of our information, we go back into EndNote, we open it up, and in EndNote we will have an option to make these changes. So we select Edit and Output Styles. So in here we have an option to edit the style that I'm using. So I'm using Annotated. If I edit that, it brings up a series of options. So the first thing is, in my citations, I have a template option. So this is showing me how my current citation appears. If I wanted to add in a comma after the author, I select right beside the author and I click a comma. If I want to make a change to my actual reference appearance or my bibliography template, I select it down here, the same thing, bibliography template. So this is how the generic reference will appear. If, for example, just so we can see, I'm using a journal article in my example. So I'm just going to make this bold just so we can see the change. So the title of my journal should now, or sorry, the title of my article will now appear in bold. So if I close this, it's asking me if I want to save my changes to annotated. I select yes. It's a system a, f a format so I will have to kind of create my own version of it so it's going to set up a style called annotated copy so we just need to remember that for a second so we save it and back into my report here where I have my citation I'm still on annotated so what I need to do now is to search for the style that I just created so I come in here and here I select annotated copy so all things going well it connects to EndNote and may ask me to make changes to my reference and if I scroll back here to my document here it's inserted my new style and hopefully if I scroll down to my reference my title is now in bold so we can make any change we want we can reorder our references if we need to if we need to put the title first or if we need to change our volume or issue or our page numbers appear